my name's Ian, and today we're going to have a look at do, creating a simple Gantt chart in uh, Excel for sort of um, a, a little bit of a bathroom reno. It doesn't really matter what the project is, but you'll see as we go along, it's just going to show you who's coming when and what has to happen, and um, it makes it really easy to see um, how the job should progress and when you need to order things. So anyway, um, I'm going to show you also a little bit today on setting up the spreadsheet before I start, you know, what you what you normally see. So I come across and I go up to the top left hand corner, which is like global. And you see when I've done that, it's selected the whole thing. And I come up here and I'm just going to bump the font up a little bit, make it bigger. I wouldn't normally do that, but I do that to make it easier to see for the videos. And Arial, because I like it. It's what suits me. So, okay, so first part of the project. We pick a spot, because we're just going to get the feel for it. And uh, I'm going to call this one Day 1. Perfect, but I don't want to have that across like that. What I need to do then is right click and then I'm going to come down here to format cells and I click on the little tab here that says alignment and I come across here and I'm going to bump that round the corner there up like that and go OK and you can see now I can make it this way so also we'll do I'll just do a control C copy well you like know, right click whichever way you want to do it and then I'm gonna select a few here and right click and if I go to the first one it keeps the you know all the formatting and everything's the same so I've got to do that and I can come up to the top here and then all I've got to do is click that and I can change that to two. Okay, so you get the gist for that. So we've got vertical text, which is looking pretty good. We've got day one, day two. So, uh, Sparky, I should really write electrician, but you know, it is my video, so I can get to do whatever I like. And then I'm going to go Carpenter. And Plumber. And who else will we have? Because it's just a little demo. We would have uh, Carpenter, Plumber, and... Plastra. Right on. So, nothing too drastic there. All looks the same as it would any other spreadsheet. But, and I've just, all I've done is moved those cells so that I, if I wanted to, I can also do this, which probably should have showed you this. Global and hit center everything it lines up into the center. So that top little button up there, that's pretty handy. So, right, Sparky. So I'm gonna go and set the fill there to blue. Carpenter, I'll pull that down and I'm gonna pick a color. I should have, gold I think is suitable for a carpenter. Plumber, uh, let's pick another color. And we'll make him red. And then we'll come down here and we'll go to Plastra. And we'll make him green. Okay. So, on our first little look into it, we've got to uh, think about who would go there first. To the first part of the job. Okay. And I would have the sparky there to disconnect 
all the electrical out of that work. Even before anyone else comes, make sure that it's safe. So as we're pulling bits and pieces down, so I come up here, I go uh, first, I'm going to go Control C. I'm here. Come across to here, and then I'm going to go Control V, and I'm going to paste that because day one, he's coming. Okay, and I'm not going to have someone there at the same time because that's one of the good things about these Ganchats is showing, you know, so you don't have your trades on top of each other. You just have who you need and there when they need to be. So next we're going to have the plumber and I'll control C that and he's coming day two and he's going to come for two days. Control V. So he's going to disconnect everything and also make it safe. And depending on what is on what the renovation is, he might even start and do a bit of roughing if they're depending on the job. Okay, and then we're going to control C the carpenter, and he's going to come for three days. Control V. And then uh, the next one, we're going to get the plasterer, control C, over here, control V, and then we put the plaster in. So now we can start to see what order that the trades are coming, what days they're coming, and so on. And what I do when I get really serious into it, I have a sheet and I write down what's going to happen on day one. Sparky's coming, I can see that, but he's going to disconnect um, and take the fuses out and make it safe for, every, you know, plumber's going to do this, start roughing in, and I have that list. But it also allows me for things like on this day here, day two, I might be ringing someone like the plasterer and checking their availability that he's still coming speak to the waterproofer, speak to the cabinet maker and make sure he's booked in ready because when the plaster is done, we need him to come and measure. So all those key points all along the way. And then, of course, you know, Indeed. like um, in my way of thinking, nothing happens, uh, no tiles go on the wall till I've had another payment. Okay, so that that's sort of one of my personal thing so that's a key key point that day anyway you can see easy enough to set up so anyway hope that gets you started on simple ganch oh last thing she nearly forgot when we get to it we come down here and we select these cells and right click and format cells and this time border uh, outline inline and I'll select all I like that one there that's sort of reasonable color colored and there you go so when it prints out none of those faint gray lines will print but those cells inside with those borders done they'll print out just the way you expect okay all right I think I've got it all covered now have a great one. Speak to you soon. Bye.